Hey everybody, it's Jason Creel and this is the Lawn Care Life. Today I'm going to talk to you about Darwin's Grip. And some of you probably seen this. Uh, Darwin's Grip was a sponsor at my last uh, Lawn Care Life conference. And I think they gave away four of these at the conference and then they gave me one to try out. So I wanted to, this would be my first time. I just put it on uh, just uh, a few minutes ago. And basically, you can see I cranked it up just to make sure that I like the way it feels. So basically the way it works, uh, it attaches real easy. You just need an Allen wrench there to attach it and you can you know, put it wherever's comfortable. I put it in kind of very similar position to where my previous handle was. And then what these two, you can adjust these with an Allen wrench as well. And that allows you to you know, raise this up. You can have it higher or lower. So I, I kind of set it a little bit lower. I kind of played with it to uh, find the position that was comfortable for me with this handle so I've got it where where I like it and I want to just show you I'm gonna do a little trimming around the house and uh, see how it feels uh, a couple things I noticed about it one that the, the whole idea behind this is, is by the name Darwin Grip. it's like if you, if you see on their website they'll show somebody kind of hunkered over and when you use a string trimmer especially if you're taller. Now, if you're short, it may not come in as handy. I'm about six foot tall. Uh, but if if you use the handle, sometimes you have kind of a natural bent to your, to your posture. And so the idea is for this handle, you can stand up straighter and not have to bend over. Uh, I can see, especially if I'm on a hill, kind of leaning down, you know, it's just gonna give you a longer reach to be able you know, to keep putting much strain on your back. And, you know what, when you, when you use one of these all day, it does uh, put a strain on you a little bit. So anyway, but overall, uh, it's very well built and let's demonstrate it and put it to work. I do, I do got my uh, eye and ear protection on for those of you who like to be concerned about that. Thank you for caring. I do like the way it feels. Uh, it's, I would compare it to the first time when I started using my stand-on mower versus a, a zero turn, you know, a sit-on mower, sit-down mower, riding mower, whatever you call it. Uh, but anyway, as I started using it, it took a little while to get used to, but then you, you kind of like, uh, I like the way the, the stand-on mower. And I believe I'm gonna like this, you know. One thing I'm gonna demonstrate, uh, some of you like me like to, to edge with your string trimmer. I don't do that all the time, but, but sometimes I do. Um, you're probably gonna have to use the traditional handle when you edge. So if I'm gonna edge, at least the way I do it, I'd probably stick with the regular handle. Um, but you know, it didn't, you know, I was thinking too about on your uh, trimmer rack, you know, if it fits on the trimmer rack or trailer, you, you may have to position it in the top rack if you had had that. I'm not sure, I don't have, I don't, I'm not gonna, be able to demonstrate that but that's why i was just thinking about that I may have to go to the top rack so all right i'm gonna i'm gonna uh, show you edging a little bit with it like it's like saying flip upside down edge it but i'm gonna get on a hillside here in a minute and see how it feels just being on a hillside so i'm gonna do a little more trimming and we'll wrap up the video oh i do want to say i'm using the uh 
sometimes people ask what trimmer I use. This is a Husqvarna 525LS. I don't know if this model still being made or not, but, but I like it a lot. I used to have the 326LS, now I got the 525LS, and I just like the Husqvarna trimmers. comment put one on there about me walking backwards sometimes people like to say don't walk backwards you know that's a, a classic comment when it comes to edging with a string trimmer i'm gonna try the hillside here and uh, see how it goes
that's enough for today. Has, uh, if, you're not, if you're not using your trimmer yet, it's been at the time of this video is March, you'll be, it'll be soon. It's almost time. This is the first time I've uh, got mine out this year and used it much. And you know, I like the uh, I like the Darwin's groove. It's well made. It's gonna take a little bit of getting used to, but if, if it's something that you you have back pain or you you just wanna when you're a tall guy and you don't like bending down, I can see some real uses for it. So anyway, he uh, he did give me this product and he gave me a discount code for those of you who wanna uh, get one. I'll put that in the description if you wanna uh, check that out. There's also, I know some other videos on there that other people have done about the Darwin scripts. Go check those out. I haven't watched them, so I'm not sure what they say about it. But uh, if you like watching me use a string trimmer, I've got some other videos me doing that that I will put at the end of this video on the end screen that'll pop up so check those out one uh, that some people like is the 10 skills to master with a string trimmer talk to you later I'm Jason Creel subscribe to the channel see ya bye